Alright, so hello, yeah, I'm I'm skipping the skin eh? I'm not gonna spend more. If I got early, okay, I'll take it. <laughs> Okay, so let's take a look at Hallet. <clears throat> Characteristic first, eh? Effective only in speed, mini boost power plus 6%. Within 38 seconds of start, mini boost. No, basic. Eh? Base max speed plus 5 km per hour. Nitro max speed plus 4 km per hour. And tank is plus 4% per second. Every 4 times uh, ending the drift, your base max speed plus 6 second. What is this? Base max speed plus 6.5 km per hour for 6 seconds. So, early game car for 38 seconds, base max speed increase, nitro max speed increase, and end tank increase. And every 4 times you end drift, your base max speed increase some more. So, that's a lot of base max speed increase. Eh? And for item, mini boost power plus 25%, mini boost max speed plus 8km per hour, mini boost duration plus 0.05 seconds. Okay, a bit longer mini boost there. Eh? Base max speed plus 6 km per hour. Every two times you use banana, UFO, magnet or lightning, you will immediately get three mini boosts and the duration of the mini boost and base max speed will be increased to four times within seven seconds. Oh the multiplier will be four times, okay, for seven seconds. So for the mini boost duration you get 0.05 seconds, okay? And your base max speed uh, plus 6 km per hour, okay? So if you uh, use any two items, okay, uh, banana, UFO, magnet, or lightning, you get three mini boosts. Hmm, I, I, I kind of want to test item also later. Three mini boosts, and then your mini boost duration will plus zero point two second because it's uh, four times. Eh? So your mini boost duration will be plus zero point two second. Hmm. Okay. And your base max speed plus twenty four. Is it? Plus 6 right? So 4 times that will make it 24 km per hour. Wow! <laughs> okay, I'm, I'm curious on how strong is Hallet in item as well. Eh? It has to be good for item as well. Plus the ECU, you can use it for item. Oh, okay. Alright, anyway, let's take a look at the ECU because the ECU is what makes this T car broken. Alright, Super ECU, Eternal Burning Edge. Use the start boost to gain fusion point. So the fusion point is actually what you use uh, when you press your ECU. Down, okay? When you use your ECU, you are using your fusion point. So you do a start boost and you will gain your ECU. That, that's what it means. Huh? So after using your ECU, you immediately gain 100% end tank. So you basically get a nitro immediately. And you will get one mini boost every 0.6 second within 4.8 second. That's basically EXA. Eh? So if you use EXA ECU, you get mini boost every 0.6 second, right? So same like EXA, but not exactly as long as EXA. That's like only for 4.8 seconds. So you can get like eight boosts only, lah. Okay. Unlike EEXA, you can get 14, right? 14 mini boosts. Hallet only gives you eight mini boosts. So it just helps you, uh, well, start with WCW. You start, you press uh, start boost, ECU, CW with your ECU. So, yeah, <laughs> that's what makes this car broken. Eh? You start with uh, WCW straight away with one ECU. And your, not only that, your, bit, your mini boost max speed will plus 7 km per hour for 15 seconds. So, yeah, basically early game now. If you start straight away with ECU, your speed increase 7 km per hour for 15 seconds or so quite long and <laughs> broken okay yeah so I can't wait to test this let's begin <clears throat> one tier activation modding okay <laughs> I, again I still can't believe it okay modding middle left left and left okay same like the other Tika right let's test out Hallet Okay, so I'm testing out uh, Hallet with the ECU. Eh? So first off, we test out the normal speed and everything. And now we use the ECU. Okay, now we don't use the ECU yet. Normal speed is 210.8. Double boost 256.7. CWW 325. WCW 306.6. And I made a mistake there. <laughs> Hold on. Okay, this is characteristic. WCW 335.1. 
329.5 I think it's without Okay And now The early game Characteristic is gone Normal speed is 205.8 Double boost 258.2 But I think that's with characteristic 322.5 Let me test without Okay still activate 322.5 still Or 316 eh Okay, don't drift. CW. 316, yeah. Okay, 316, but when you activate, it's 322.5, yeah. Let me try again. Let's try to activate the ECU at the start. So, start boost. That's not how to do it. <laughs> I need to figure out how to do it later. So you have to boost ECU and then CW. I think that's the right way because you don't get a nitro at the start unless you ECU. So boost ECU and then boost CW. Is it? Let me, let me try. Yeah, like that. Okay. Literally early game start. Eh? The, the best early game car. Eh? So you can just scroll like this, uh. scroll to, from your boost to the ECU to the nitro and then back to the boost. That's how you start with Hallet. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah, let's a really broken early game right? now if I do the game set cool down I think that's a cool down for the ECU right? hello? <laughs> okay sure I don't know alright anyway let's try this in uh... I wanna try CT11 also but I want to try short maps also. <laughs> okay, we'll we'll try them both. So even though this is more for early game maps, even for long maps also, this is good. You know, a lot a lot make this, a lot of things that this car is broken. <laughs> so let's try CT11 first. I guess that works. What the heck? And then I'll just play normally. Okay, just finish up with the micro. Yeah, it's not as long as his EXA. I have to remember that it's only... Ah, why is it lagging?
158 okay <clears throat> so yeah the ECU makes this car broken if I'm playing this without any early game uh, ECU if I'm using this with a bling ECU this car doesn't feel that strong huh? by looking at the speed it can reach 330 20 something but uh, I think that's because of the characteristic activate right so it's basically just like the usual T car's speed lah. Better than T duck, <laughs> definitely. <laughs> speed is faster than T duck, but still, uh, yeah, you must have the ECU. If you don't have the ECU, that it doesn't feel that strong. Okay, the ECU is what makes this car broke. Okay, let's try a short map. Uh, Wild West or maybe the other one. What's the new map right now? Oh, Jiangxi, right? Okay, maybe I'll try Jiangxi. I heard. Jiangxi is actually the best uh, the, the the best car to use is actually Harlot But I don't know how to use Harlot <laughs> in, in here But I'll just give it a try Supposedly this is better than other cars But the thing is I'm not so sure how to use Harlot yet <laughs> Let's see what I can do So boost is you Okay, I'm already overtaken because that's a blingy CU. Ayo, where do I see you here? Where should I second see you? <laughs> I don't know. Oh. oh, why am I so lagging? I guess right here. Oh. Okay, that was quite bad, but <laughs> yeah, I, I'm not used to Hella yet. Okay, but it's supposed to be good. Though. The early game is already the broken thing, so I just have to not make mistakes and I'll st I'll stay in front. Lah. But just now, because of the lag, also I blame the lag as well, and I don't know how to use the ECU. <laughs> okay. So, wait, I'll need to do another recording just to make sure I need more, maybe I need more storage, that's why it's lagging. Okay, I'm playing rank team speed. I think like this is a good time to review Hallet. <laughs> I'm playing with Bunny and Zoom Kit. Eh? So, boost is you. It is Zoom Kit, understand. <laughs> Only six boots, eh?
Oh no. Come on, Zonkit. Stay in front. Nice. Zonkit carry. <laughs> okay, so. My impression that if you're playing on uh, not really a short map, it's like a normal map like this. You always get a good start, but uh, if you do make a bit of mistakes, of course, uh, people are gonna overtake you. Lah. So, the longer the map, the more people will overtake you. This is Supreme rank, by the way. Uh, Nova to Supreme. Lah. Let's try to get a short map. Well, there's no short maps here. But uh, long maps like Atlantis uh, by Spen also can work. We get Troy map. Mm, Troy map. Where can we see you here? Of course, the first one will have to be at the start. The second one. We'll, f we'll see. That. <laughs> That's a good start, really. Question is where do I use the next one? So don't mess up. Now you're in front. Don't mess up. One person is connect ready. Right, I have, I always have nitro, so I don't really know where to see it. That works. <laughs> nice, perfect game. Let's go. Okay, I think uh, Bunny's changing to the main account. Alright. We don't have short maps here. <laughs> but still, Helot can be usable in some maps here. Yeah? And we get flowers in the summer sea. Okay. My thoughts will be ECU at the start, of course. The second one maybe at the end. Let's see how this works. And yeah, this time it's with Bunny. Eh? Bunny is a, a main account. Bunny is using Luna Shadow. Good choice here. Alright, I got the Ace Racer thingy. Yep, T5. Boost ECU. CW W. That's the start there. Eh? Isn't this broken or what? <laughs> Well, I can use here also, but uh, I think the end better. Right now, it's not about issue on nitro, it's about uh, getting mini boosts. I don't know, maybe that was better. No. <laughs> ah, never mind. I'll use it here.
and perfect 122 eh <laughs> isn't that broken or what well I should have waited ah no ah money could have made it ah never mind <laughs> it's team speed so I guess it doesn't really matter <laughs> yeah I could have waited it might mistake I was trying to see how fast can I go with Hallet Short map, okay we are doing some time, we have scenic hills, Grand Canyon, I don't think that's a good idea Let's see which one we get Highway 1, okay it's kinda short, I guess ECU, well where can I use, one at the start, the second one would be maybe at the, the end, I'm not so sure, where can I use or maybe the straight road usually where we ECU you at the first time. Okay, we'll see. <laughs> last. Uh, last, that's uh, the other guy. Okay. ECU. Be here. I'll just I don't know, maybe that was a bad idea. Let's go! 110! 110.99! <laughs> what a run! <laughs> Dunes of Time! We still haven't get Dunes of Time! <laughs> Can we get a Dunes of Time? Or maybe... Another short map. Uh, I guess this will do. Yeah, I'm going full Hallet no matter what the map is. Eh? But if I'm uh, playing normally, I will not be using uh, Hallet all the time because some Tikas are still better. Alright, here we go. Oh, <laughs> okay. So far when I'm playing Hallet, I'm just thinking don't mistake because I'm already in front. So I think we can, we can wait. Bunny's around third fourth. We can wait for him. Uh, maybe. <laughs> Good thing, uh, you still won. So yeah, Hallet is broken, right? You can avoid, uh, everyone and be in front already straight away. 
But I say it's all thanks to the ECU. Without the ECU, this wouldn't be a very good uh, card to use as early game. All right, one more rank. Let's not play no mate. Uh, okay. <laughs> I was hoping to get Atlantis, but of course people will ban it. Sichuan. I'm not even changing pet. I think Sichuan should be okay. The ECU I can think of where I should use early. Second will be... I don't think I should use a star boost. Not sure where should I second uh, use it. <clears throat> That didn't help much. <laughs> uh, we might be losing here if Bunny doesn't finish. Unless you think you're stuck. I'm not sure. Um, oh, wait. Okay, Zunki got stuck. So we still won no matter what. That would have gone bad if uh, Zunki got fourth. So yeah. So far it's all the win. <laughs> but yeah. Tier 3, nice. Okay, Bunny finished both advancements. Okay, I'm including this run because we got City 11 Reef. <laughs> we got City 11, so yeah, might as well include this run. <clears throat> Let's see if I can.
bunny gave up but we can still win this oh. One fifty-five. Okay. Well, my first run was better. <laughs> okay, so I'm switching to QQ just to see what actually, uh, what maps are actually good using Hallet. Eh? And like as you can see, here, City Eleven is the best. Okay, to use Hallet, even though it's not a short map, but it's uh, suitable because of the part where. It's like a straight road, so using Hallet is useful. Better than Olina. Eh? Not all short maps, uh, Hallet is suitable. Well, this one is still Hallet, eh? but some other early game cars like uh, Chrono Envoy is still better, also, still okay. Use of Time, also Hallet. So, yeah, Hallet is like dominating most of the early game. Early game, the short maps, eh? okay. Even though Luna Shadow can be good, uh, other early game cars can be good. Hallet is the best right now, lah. The Eternal, yeah, this one also Hallet. Yeah, Sky City also can use Hallet. Scenic Hills also can use Hallet. Winter Gorge also. So like, yeah, you can see lah. Most of the uh, early game, the short maps lah. Oh, how do you know? Eh? Autumn Story also can, yeah. Autumn Story also can use Hallet. Great Wall. Great Wall also can Hallet, but the best one is the T6. EXA, Fire Tiger also can. But a lot of Hallet. Eh? Atlantis and Reverse, even though uh, it's not short, also Hallet. Eh? Surprisingly, reverse also had it. Only a few fan. Uh, what's it called? Phantom Star, Dinosaur World. Some is T six. Some is Hallet. Hmm, Hallet also. Eh? <laughs> so you can see lah, a lot of Hallet. Uh, dominating the maps. Grand Canyon, also can use Hallet. Ice Soul also can. And we go to the more difficult ones like this one, Hallet. This is Hallet, right? Like, Yep, this is Hallet confirmed. This one also Hallet. <laughs> so yeah, basically that's it lah. A lot of uh, a lot of maps you can use Hallet. It's the best car to use because of the early game. But not all Hallet might be the ECU Hallet. Eh? Some maps like Wild West. Wild West still prefer Bling ECU compared to uh, the Hallet ECU because. Uh, the shortcuts you better use EC, the bling ones, uh, okay? That is Hallet. Very broken. The broken part is actually the ECU. So I'll say, uh, um, yeah. Not all maps you can use Hallet. So Hallet does it, dominates most of the maps, but uh, not all maps uh, can be using Hallet. Eh? You always get a start, early game start, but you have to boost straight away ECU and then uh, do CWW. So you can actually WCWW at the start. And that is just uh, overtakes everyone eh? at, in the beginning. And then you don't have to worry about overtaking anyone or whatever. You are in front already. So all you have to do is just finish the, get, finish the damn race <laughs> without any mistakes. Once you do a mistake, ah, then you cannot catch up lah. So yeah, the thing about this car, because it's an early game car, any characteristic later on will not help lah. I mean, later in the late game, if you still, uh, if you already used up all your ECU, and if you mess up somewhere, yeah, you, you can't really catch up back lah. Because the car's characteristic is only within 38 seconds of start. That's when you get all the buffs. And also every 4 times drift ends, you got a uh, base max speed increase, but that doesn't uh, really help much. Huh? It does help much, but, but not, not, as, not so much as the other two cars. Compared to uh, like EXA, 
every nitro you get M tank. Every nitro, every boost you use increases your nitro speed, and so on. Sun Wukong acceleration zone buffs. Uh, you can nitro on acceleration zones and stuff, right? You get a nitro first, uh, extra nitro when you touch an acceleration zone for the first time. So later in the late game. People can chase the helmet, but in the early game you can't chase. So that's the thing. You just have to. If you are battling helmet, the problem is you have to catch up with the helmet to win, <laughs> and hope that the person driving helmet doesn't mistake and uh, does does some mistakes. Uh. So yeah, really quite broken Tika. Okay, the broken part, like I said again, is the ECU because. You straight away can WCW in the start of the race, and then ECU similar like uh, EXA but just uh, halfway. And then with you ECU again, you get another Nitro, and then you can uh, boost again like ECU EXA again. So yeah, quite <laughs> quite a broken T car. Again, I'm glad I got this early. I'm skipping the skin. <laughs> But yeah, if you wanna, if you are going for the skin, okay. Uh, I heard it's about twenty five thousand actually the original price to gacha helmet, and then plus another three to five thousand diamonds to get the skin. That's what I heard. So if you get the skin, eh, you can upgrade your skin because uh, yeah, it looks just like that. It looks the same, right? The animation and all. But it has 7 levels eh, if you are going to upgrade and this is going to cost even more. <laughs> so if you level 2, you have a cooler animation of going in the Tika. Level 3, I guess the picture is different. Yeah, it's a, bet a bit better model, eh, intermediate model. Level 4, you get extra XP. So yeah, for those who really want to level up as fast as possible, you might want this. You might want, uh, especially if you are a whale spending a lot, uh, you might want to use Hallet to get extra XP. Okay, yeah, for those who wants to quickly go to level 100, yeah, you might you might want to upgrade to this level at least. Level five, gift box drop. Okay, this one. Uh, Distribute random gift packs to the same player at the start. So yeah, you just randomly give any of the player that you that you are meeting with. This one seems like Olina la. Olina also got this uh, random gift box drop. <laughs> so you are giving uh, any player that you meet a gift pack or something like that. Level six, even cooler the Tika. And level 7, you have a room entrance animation. That one, not so sure. But yeah, this is gonna cost even more if you're going for all these skin upgrades. Okay, <laughs> that's even more. Which I'm not going for it. I, having this is enough for me. Okay. Right, so that's it for Highlight Review. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys next time.